Hello everyone, this is Meltman of Gaming Philosophy. Welcome to the stream. Uh, so, I'm going to be doing some standing up VR today. Uh, I'm going to be doing some Boneworks. I tried Boneworks once in the past, sitting down, and um, I started feeling a little nausea with that. Um, off camera, I tried t working with different things to see how it would work better for me. And I think my best so far is standing up. Um, that being said, I've had a very long day. I've had almost no sleep, so I don't know how long I'm going to be doing this stream. Um, I was going to try to sleep. I had laid down and tried to get some sleep, but my body says, you're exhausted. I mean, my brain goes ahead and says, Mel, you're exhausted. Go to sleep. My body's like, but it's stream time. We need to be up. 
But we need to be doing the things. So, yeah. So here we go. Oh, I apparently grabbed my entire couch accidentally. In in my VR home. You know what? I'm just gonna leave that there for now. I thought it was frozen in place. Oh, I did go ahead and do some things with my VR home recently. I suppose I can go ahead and give you a quick turnaround. See who do we have? Wrong mic. Oh, wrong mic. Wrong mic. Oh. Testing, 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 testing. Oh, all right. Let's go ahead and do this over again. Hello, everyone. This is Meltman of Gaming Philosophy. Welcome to the stream. I am apparently tired. <laughs> if you can't tell. Um, it's been a very long uh, day. I haven't been able to get any sleep. Uh, family things that are unavoidable. I need to make sure that someone stayed safe, so I had to stay by their side for the majority of the time that I was supposed to be sleeping. So, I am exhausted, and that is obvious, but when I tried to lay down and get some extra sleep before streaming, my body was like, but it's stream time! We should do stuff! So, yeah, I'm streaming anyways. Uh, so, uh, last time I played Boneworks, I did it as a sitting down experience, which is what's recommended, but I started feeling a bit nauseous. I played trying to tool around with it to figure out what works best for me, and I found that I feel less nauseous if I'm actually standing up and all moving a little bit with the experience. So that's what I'm going to be doing today. Um, also, let's pop this down. Yeah! Okay, good. It sounds better now. Thank you, Godless, for being here. I did some work on my room in Steam VR. Let's see here. Try to get my borders to go away. So you don't see them. Got the Ready Player One book there because of reasons. Batman Evil Within, Seven Days, Abzu, Poker Night 2, Slime Rancer, Resident Evil, you know. Get some Steam trophies over here. The Forest, Jurassic World, Depth, Armello, BPM. In Silence, Astroneers, Innermost, I Expect You to Die, Farlone Sales, Dying Light, Friday the 13th, Frostpunk. We got all the hits over here. Don't mind my couch, it's being stupid. Subnautica, State of Decay, The Walking Dead, Spyro, The Walking Dead, The Walking Dead, Borderlines from Telltale, more Walking Dead. Maybe I should have moved that over there. Hmm, might do that later. The Surge, Skyrim, Rios, more Resident Evil, Argami, Anode 2205, A Plague Tale, The Longing, which I still need to finish, Call of Cthulhu, Graveyard Keeper, which I still need to finish, Fallout 4, which I finished too much, <laughs> uh, Doom, Borderlands 2, is that Darksiders? Yeah, that's Darksiders. Killing Room, Hell Sign. That's just a small portion. A very small portion. I had to pick and choose which trophies I put because I literally, when I went through my Steam trophies, it was a lot. But that's not what we're calling here today. I'll have to fix my couch later. Oh. I did some changes outside. Um... The backdrop is more of a Skyrim backdrop now for my world. The trees are huge! And I made a Karn. I mean, I've been playing so much Assassin's Creed that, you know, the only thing you have to be careful of is uh, all these rocks here are interactable. Yep. I'll fix it later. That thing, if you go ahead and knock into it, it all will go tumbling. I'm not going to try to fix it right now. 
All right, so Baby Boneworks, launch the game. Here we go. Launch it. How's everybody's nights going? How's everybody doing? Okay, center my play space. Oh. This might be a good note. Mythos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I am getting fed up with the cord. This is where the computer is, right? Yeah, I'm getting fed up with the cord. How did I accidentally, looking away, go ahead and click the button? So, what I'll be doing is there's a... There's a company called Kiwi VR that has this really cool ceiling pulley system that I'm going to be looking in to pick up to suspend the cord from the ceiling. The only thing is, with that, I have to make sure that I don't turn my ceiling fan on <laughs> because that would be bad. So, okay. I am 5'10". Yes. I will be playing standing. Yes. You can always switch your settings. Auto guess confirm. So I should be, I should be basically in sight with him in the game, and I am. Good. All right. Offset floor. Auto guess. There you go. Save savings. New 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 new. I've never seen that actually fall before because I'm always looking that way because for some reason when this game launches, it launches with a title screen here instead of here. Even though I've told my setup, this is the front of the room. It seems convinced that I should be always looking with my back to you guys. I don't by default. I do not know why. All right. So... I'm going to try to combat that the best I can. Okay. Oh. All right. So, we are going to... Con We're going to level select this. Because I, in trying to get back to where I was, I had gone a little too far and I went... I didn't go out to the streets, but I hit a load zone that I hadn't hit before, which unlocks this streets option, so I don't know what's there. So we're going to go back to the museum, which is where I left off. And actually, my first time playing this is what's premiering on YouTube right now. Is it USB? No, 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 no. This cable, this cable, is, it's a USB and HDMI. So it's, it's, it's multi-port. That's why this cable is so beefy and thick and heavy. Because it's got a, a USB and graphics uh, display, which makes sense. I mean, VR, you know, feeding through it. <laughs> mm -hmm. I really need to get an SSD for my rig. It would make these load times, I think, go a whole lot faster. This is only going to get worse when I get Cyberpunk, I think, because their recommended requirements are SSD for your hard drive. Well, a solid state drive, not a hard drive, technically. Okay. Oh, okay. So, also with Boneworks, 
they have this loading in when they're loading in the textures where all the textures are very blurry at first. It always screws with my eyes. Okay, here we go. Now this says object confetti. So it just contains confetti. So there we go. We're gonna go through this as quick as possible. I'm gonna try to get as much as I can. And we are going to continue on. Yeah, pretty sure these are all empty. Yeah, so I'm not gonna worry too much about it. Open. Barrier there. Okay, so I saw that I need to press all of the buttons because there's actually a thing that counts how many buttons you press. So, not gonna bother watching you. Uh, okay. I already saw this. I got the gist. Yep. I'm just gonna go ahead and yeah. So we gotta push all the buttons. There we go. I'm pushing the buttons to make sure that I've pushed them because apparently there is a thing that happens when you push all of them and there's like 43 buttons. Hoop. And now, yay! I love that. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's such a it's just, just a sad, sad sound. <sighs> yeah, I feel so much better doing it personally. Alright. Keeping an eye out for Ooh. buttons. <sighs> Okay, well that 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 did not that did not feel good. Let's try this again. Bye bye. Hi. Right. Grab to save. Thank you. No, thank you. Okay. So we haven't missed any buttons. As far as I know, I pressed all the buttons. All of the buttons. There are some buttons that are going to be hard to get to. Whoa! <laughs> all right. I can't. 
How can I say no to that? Huh? I don't think there's any buttons back there. So, I don't worry about it. Uh, uh, uh. Huh. Discount companion cube, discount portal button. It has been pressed. And now we can move on. That isn't such an SCP thing. I still want to know how I'll get in this room. I can see it. I can see it. Be quiet, phone. I heard that. All right, nothing. Nothing to press there. Oh, no, not this. I hate this. I hate this. Okay, this was so, so rough on me when I was doing sitting down VR. I remember this. Been such chore. Hopefully it'll be better me standing up. Oh. Ha, ha, he, ha. Ah, oh, spring in my step. Okay. Oh, oh, there's a button up there. Oh, I think I know how to get to it, too. <laughs> ah, tricksy, tricksy. I could parkour, or I could climb. Oh, crap, what did I just hit? I just hit my light. Great. Yeah. I don't know if there's an M2 on my motherboard, though. It's a fairly old motherboard, and I think it may have been released before M2 became a uh, mainstay feature on most motherboards. So I'll have to check that, Godless. But that's a good point. So, rather than doing some annoying parkour to be able to pull this down and jumping all over this, we are going to go ahead and Hmm. There's... Huh. How am I gonna work this out? Because if it has my weight on it, it drops. And I don't want it to drop. There's gotta be a climbing material or something that I can utilize. <sighs> nope. Well. <clears throat> I'm currently in the pillar. get that button. The audio, is there audio in-game? Are you not picking up the in-game audio? I mean, there's not much going on right now. Huh. Here. Testing, 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 testing. Ah. <sighs> 
why why isn't in-game audio picking up well that's why there you go because Streamlabs pulled a foot oopsie and basically was putting it oh yeah your v your your audio for vr it's just going to be the default device whatever that is when i specifically set it to be the audio being fed to the uh hdc index so i mean the the vibe valve index so mm. <sighs> why must things be so hard why must things always break on me? Thank you for going ahead and being my uh, eyes and ears in chat. Godless, I don't know what I'd do without you. There we go. Standing up quickly again. Hmm. See, what I'm supposed to do is go all the way around there and jump all over there. But I could shortcut it just by climbing this pole here. I need to get to that button there. I think I'm going to go ahead and do this. I'm going to do a cheat a doodle. <laughs> so doing all that little shenanigans over there. I'm just going to do this. And I'm going to do this. So for the sake of pressing all of the buttons. Yeah. No, I accidentally pressed it again. Okay. All right. There we go. The Museum of Technical Demonstration is brought to you by Paul. 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 All right. Just go ahead and just. All right. Now this is going to be the challenge. There's a button. There's a button. But I can grab him. And climb him. Climb that butt. Smack it. Smack it. Oh, I'm sorry. Rude of me. I apologize. like a swing, right? I can only imagine what the other one's going to be like. 
You know what? I got an idea. Be right back. I need something with some length to it. This'll do. Now we'll be able to pull it off. Oh, might as well get this button pressed. Okay. Come here, you. You thought I was done with you. there. Ah, there we go. There you go. Reset my height. And there we go. And now... three buttons pressed so now we have a giant man no longer suspended Excuse me? The game beeped at me. I did something. Show me how the inventory system always works. Button. Give me ammo. No, that. No, I, there we go. There we go. Oh. Huh. Hi, Dagger. They're adding radiation in Wasteland some days. Yay. His chat isn't updating? What do you mean? I'll let him know. What do you mean? I'm just not... Uh... You mean... There we go. Sorry about that, guys. Apparently I accidentally left it alt-tabbed and it doesn't like to update if it's alt-tabbed. Come here, you. Get in. This is the recycler. If I throw stuff in, I keep it. We've already recycled all that stuff, so... So... Okay, so I pressed all the buttons. 
That, that is my only goal to press all of the buttons. That and I need to get as much ammo out of here as possible. Now, I think there's something up here. But I don't know. So I'm going to climb. Oh, don't. Go wibbly wobbly on me now. Maybe I should climb in close to the wall. That way if it wibbly wobbles. Oh, God. For some reason my grip was slipping there. Nothing up there. Oh, on that side. I didn't check this side. Quit slipping, damn it. Yeah, still nothing up there. Okay. Alright. Huh. Let's see here. How are you already? Hmm. Yeah. All right. Much better and faster than I did last time. Alright. Excuse me. You, in there. Wow. I actually don't want this one. This one. I want. Okay. Now. Take that off that one. So. I like the fact that it has a hollow sight. Alright. Now. Whoop. What I'm doing is I'm looking for any buttons. the machete. There we go. So, this is the loadout I got going on. AR hollow sight. I uh, got myself a nine ball uh, machine pistol. A regular, I'm assuming, uh, 32 or nine millimeter pistol. So, and then we have the machete. 
I think that works. Oh, ho, 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 ho! Oh, no, oh God! It bounced off, came straight back at me. All right. Now I wonder. Something that I... <sighs> I was thinking there might be a box hidden up in there. And I bet you could climb all over on that if you wanted to. These hands. Pardon me. Something in my throat. Whoa. Whoa. Get out. So this is the... Even I'm moving slower. Oh. So I can do this. So if I go like this. Okay, so that's... Half, fourth, fifth. Okay. Now this one was a little ingenious. See, oh, let me grab the controller. I did go ahead and get this one mastered off screen. So... See if I go ahead and take this little dude here and go. This thing will come and get me. So what I gotta do is tease it just a little bit down there. And then I've got to go ahead and go, See ya! Oh, did he get me? Dang it! Oh, crap. I was walking in real life. That's the thing. Oh, it got me again. How did I get away from it the first time? Hmm, I wonder. There we go. Now I have enough time. 
And there we go. Safe zone. Now we can go and walk down here. Let me take this. And what you do is go. Oh, 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 and that pushes that. We don't need that anymore. And that gives you this right here. Okay. Hey. Wrong button. Inventory. And you go right there. Alright. Now. This right here has like an emancipation field from like um portal where all your stuff is going to get toasted if you walk through it but i think the other door over here doesn't have an emancipation field and i want to save all the kit that i got going on so what i'm gonna do okay See, this door is locked, but you can unlock it later. Oh. Huh. You can unlock it now. Sweet. And there we go. No emancipation field. So. Aw, oh, shoot. I tr there's an emancipation field there. So I can't take anything with me. Shoot. Alright. So you look straight down, you can still see outside the, the uh, headset that I'm apparently wearing on top of my headset. Really at her works. Hi, Daniel. Have I been bonging? Oh, God. Okay. Now. The whole point is to press all the buttons. I do not believe I have pressed all the buttons. But that's ammo. Give me ammo. Alright. Don't think there's any buttons in here. Just merch. So, wait, hold on. I get to keep the ammo. I need to get used to this. Don't know how I'm going to keep you. I'll figure it out eventually. All right. There we go. Got that finished. So now... Oh, hold on. I don't know what that button does. I 
The whole point was to try to go through here and press every last bitty button. All the buttons. Getting bitten. Okay. Got everything over there. We pressed all the buttons in here. No hidden buttons. So. Making sure no hidden buttons. Now for the gravity room. So I went straight through emancipation field there. Alright. And this is the anti-grav gun. You know how it is anti-grav? With balloons. I'm defying gravity! Don't think too hard on it. Oh, 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 we gotta go. We gotta go. Yeah. You don't want to be there when that happens. Okay. There's an emancipation field, there's no point in me bringing this. But, you've hit 32. 32! Really? Where did I miss a button? There's apparently one button in here that I have yet to hit. No! Gravity! Oh! Well, there's two buttons I haven't hit, but I know where this one is. Huh, come on. <clears throat> come on. I want to go down. Okay. I think we'll have to go clear over here. Will gravity stop working eventually? Who knows? There it is. Oh. Oh, that was rough. Oh, that was also rough. I'll take it on the way up. Oh. What? Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh. There we go. One button to go. Don't know where the piss it is, but it's only one button. Hopefully I'll be able to find it. And we we're back. Where is this remaining button? Where's the button? I missed a single button. It's gonna bug me. It's gonna bug me all night. But yeah. Somewhere in here? Is it a door button? Nope. Please, keep your workspace Clean forever. Clean forever. And clear. So, no guns can go through there, but trash can. Alright. Well, this is where I stopped last time off camera. I think that's an important point where we take a break, folks. Ah, practice and 
Oh, 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 come on. Really? Really, you're gonna go ahead and say that? Ugh. So for those of you that showed up, that's showing up a little later in the stream, I've had a very intense, stressful, and tiring day. I did not get to sleep at all because I had a member of the family who uh, was refusing to go to bed and was uh, causing mischief throughout the house, so it required 100% supervision. So other family members can sleep. I chose not to. So, yeah, I am feeling a bit fatigued. Security cameras with phone notification. Yeah, didn't have a chance to. I'm trash. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, great. Seriously? Game developers should hire me. I get into all sorts of stuff. I want. Apparently not. Everything breaks around here. Ooh. Brick. <laughs> Brick is weapon. Come here. find something useful in these boxes. Oh. Oh. There we go. Oh, hello. I know what you are. You are ammo. Nice to have a firearm. Well, I make use for a brick for now. Brick. Did I? There we go. Safety brick. Hey, buddy, you okay? Yeah. Hey. Really tired. Ooh. Oh, hello, buddy. You stuck back there? Practical particle waste? This isn't important, is it? It was nothing. Alright. I'll leave 
we've got here. God dang it. No way to go and get momentum going. worked. How about this? How about this? I have proven that this game's physics sometimes... Okay, so I'll do this. Come on. Come on. Work with me here. Okay, there we go. Oh, too close. It's a fake door! All that work for a fake door. Give me more brick. Disappoint! I don't trust bodies that are laying out like this. It makes me suspicious that they're going to get up. Are you leaving me somewhere, buddy? A present. Get out. Get. Oh, come on. Not what I wanted. There we go. Hmm. I now have a shield. Aha. Interesting. No. be saved. Melon? I cannot save the melon? No! Ooh. Permanent band may be issued. Is that a bone works box? Or is it just a box? It's just a box. Permanent bands may be issued against committing a crime. What do you call a crime? Ooh. Tetherball. I wonder if you could use that as a weapon, I wonder. Oh. We'll just leave that there. Alright. All right, folks. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'll tell you what. 
I'll tell you what, Daniel. ZipRecruiter lists all those jobs, but I'll tell you, almost all the jobs required a previous experience in game development and or a degree from college. I have neither. I have thousands and thousands of hours in a wide range of games that it, and I have been involved in so many early access games that I can't count them all. I have had back and forth with developers of indie games, but no one big enough that they'd actually hire me for anything. So, I mean, that guy's standing up. That bugs me. So it's one of those things that, uh, I gotta sit down for a bit. Oh, my back is killing me. I think I need to switch to sitting. So this is, this is the problem. Because I have a bad back, I can only do standing VR for so long. Oh, oh. and I've got a bad chair. Okay. There we go. There we go. Ah. Oh. Can I? Oh, 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 get off me. Oh, man. Okay. I'm vignetted quite a bit there. Oh. I was worried about that, but I haven't got any firearms yet, but got a hammer now. Now there's null juice everywhere. Ew. Why is there? Mm. Ah. Uh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Huh. There's a thing there. Yeah, so that, that's a visual artifact. Okay.
There's a lock there. Hmm. There was a lock there. Hmm. I could have just jumped over too. Raffle day? A brick. Alright. Ah! That's my alarm telling me that, hey, you've got enough of a power nap, you can go and stream now. Yeah. Mason, zipper. Cr <sighs> Human resource degrees is a block. I always suggest start your own business, market the business as outsourced this or that. This being game QA. Yeah, yeah. Start my own business. Okay. So instead of trying to get hired as a beta tester for games, I go ahead and start a business as beta test a beta testing service at which point I charge a fee per hour of time spent testing a game yeah is that oh are you gonna go ahead and come to life not having it I am not having it. There's more. I don't trust him. I don't trust him. Secret. Ow, I hit the freaking table. And did they say hey? The distance render is going bad. All oh, that is hurting my eyes. Oh, God. Is it looking rough for you guys, too? Like anything that's more than a few. Ah. Oh. oh. I can't look at it. I can't look at it at a distance. It just. Ah. Oh. It's killing me. I don't know what's causing this to be this way, but God, please stop. I hope I don't have to deal with this often. I say that, and then I look up and I see a bone works box. What are... Hold on. I see a no... I see a bone works box up box up there. But I need to deal with you first. Hey. Let's see here. Any removal of them is theft. Ooh, hello. Is 
Show me how much of these are filled with bricks. I'm doing the people a favor. Ooh. I wonder what's in you. Mmm. I see a plug for you around here somewhere. I think so. Okay. God dang it. I think my game must be bugging. And play promotion raffle. Okay. Oh, oh, this is going to be, this is going to be great. How am I supposed to? <clears throat> Let's try this one. They're not. Stable in any way, shape, or form. I don't know how I'm supposed to get up on top of them. Hold on. Hold on. I don't have to. Oh crap. This is turning out stellar. You make a great melee weapon, but a terrible throwing weapon. Because I got reach with this. people get bricks
Damn. What do you do? Ah. And now you're mine. Seriously. Could you be any more just absolutely horrible to deal with? Okay. Well, it's the closest thing I got to a gun right now. I'm betting. I can shoot that uh, crate out with this if I line it up correctly. Oh, why does this have to keep on going to trash? thing is hanky and jank is jank. Come on. <clears throat> Apparently I can't go ahead and hold freaking heavy as it. <clears throat> Definitely prevents you from Oh, come on. You are useless. Useless, I say. This is a neon light. No, oh, it's over here. No. Oh. Uh, what? No, 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 no. No. Oh, shh. <clears throat> mm. No. Bad. No. Bad. Bad. No, no, don't. I'm assuming this is like VR head crabs, right? Good. Oh, oh God. Let's hope we don't run into more of those things. Uh, got enough of that in Half Life Alex.
quarantine. Mm, it looks like they didn't quarantine well enough. If you ask me. Really? Really, you're gonna do this to me? God dang it. What? Oh, I don't know where this goes. Scared the shit out of me. What is what is going on with the storage system? Okay. That looks going to look great. There are a couple things that are going on right now. Second I start sitting down and playing this game, I start feeling nauseous. But I can only stand for so long because of my bad back. So I am going to go to the next save point that I can find, hopefully inside here. Somewhere. No bodies wandering around. Oh, hey. Something is an actual weapon. Inventory. I just can't. I can't. I'm starting to feel very nauseous. On top of that, I am fairly tired. I am going to go ahead and just have to get away from this. I'm sorry. 
something where I have a bad back. And where the only way I can play a game is standing up. Able to hear me now. Got the mic switched back over. I want to be able to like Boneworks. I really do. But it's just so very nauseating for me. Unless I'm standing up. But I can't maintain a stand up game because I have fused vertebrae in my back that. Standing for long periods of time just physically caused me uh, a significant amount of pain. So I have to play VR experiences that are mostly sitting down. Which has made me realize something. Full body VR may never be for me because of that. So... Um, I'm going to go ahead and switch the stream to just chatting. Okay. There we go. Switching games after a short break. Are there options for less wobble, swerve, kind of like mount sensitivity? No, Boneworks is a very indie title. It's made by a bunch of guys that really understand video games as far as cinematic feel, physical render, that sort of thing. So these are guys that they, they spend a significant amount in VR. So they understand and are they they're used to it. Whereas me, who is new, who doesn't have his VR legs, it is a nauseating experience. So they never thought to put in those kind of tools. I, I've searched for them. I've looked through the settings. Um on Half-Life Alex, they have four different locomotion. Let's zoom in the camera a little bit. Or rather, we'll just do this for now. They have four different locomotion types in VR. One of which just doesn't work for me, and that's continuous. Mm. Mm. Um, that's how they give you a, a way to tweak it. 
in Half-Life Alex. In Saints and Sinners for The Walking Dead, they have a nausea slider to smooth out the action a bit. And I have to max the nausea slider. And even then, if I'm not careful. And that game also feels much better as a standing VR title. So I think that VR is amazing. And I think, especially in The Walking Dead, everything looks so real, even though it's comic book real, because that's the art style of The Walking Dead uh, that I, I kind of expect. And therefore, it makes sense in my brain. Whereas with Boneworks, it's kind of going between somewhere between simulated reality and reality, and it just doesn't feel right. So I'm going to take a break, go use the restroom. I'll be back in a little bit, and we'll see about doing something else. Sorry, guys. It's just either my back or stomach can't take it. Standing VR, my back can't take it. But my stomach is fine if I'm doing standing VR. Uh, sitting VR just starts making me feel nauseous fairly quick. So be right back in a little bit. <laughs> 